Yo, what's up YouTube? This is Timmy from Pure Kicks, back with another unboxing video. And for those who didn't read the title, today I'm showing you guys the brand new Nike Air Max 197 Vote Forward Sean Witherspoon. Witherspoon. One of those two. So if you click on this video, I can tell you're here for one of three reasons. The shoe itself, how I got them, or potentially both. But with that being said, let's get straight into the shoe itself. So first things first, talking about the box. We've got this special corduroy print Nike logo, which basically gives us a sneak peek into the shoe itself, which looks clean. We've got four logos, the top one, both the long sides, and one at the back as well. But enough about the box, you guys ain't here for the box. Let's get into the shoe. Oh, oh yeah. What are you saying? What are you telling me? You can't get these, homie. You can't get these no more. You can't get these. Why am I talking like that? But yeah, it's true. Let's bring out the other pair. Ah, oh, let's go. Let's get rid of this damn box. Clean. Yo. You see these? You see these? The best silly word, I'm joking. You see these? Summertime vibes. That's how you know summer is here. What are you saying? These are the kicks for summer, for sure. At me if you must, but these right here, incredible stuff. We've got the same on both shoes. So I'll just, I'll just talk about one shoe then. The Air Max 97 upper with the Air Max 1 midsole and outsole with a corduroy upper inspired by the hats that Nike used to make back in the 80s. My son had on corduroys, that's why I had an attitude. Cause I didn't see it, I heard it. All I heard was ruh, ruh, ruh. I said, what the, who the hell is playing cards? What is that But it came out so clean. Ah, it came out so clean. Think about these shoes is when they first dropped a year ago, this colorway looked very different on the screen. I wasn't a huge fan of it, but then when the official images were released and the shoe was created, I was like, yep, need those, need those. Now, even though this is Sean Weatherspoon's shoe, he's been said by himself that he actually bought a few of his friends to help him with the design. And for those who want to find out a little bit more about that, hit the link down below in the description. So just like any of the signature shoes we normally talk about on this channel, the Sean Weatherspoon Air Max 197 comes with its own as well. On the very back of the pull tab, we see VA to LA, which basically talks about Sean Weatherspoon's journey from his hometown to where he's living now over in LA. And then inside the shoe, underneath your heel, you'll see that smiley face with the Nike swoosh for a mouth, which is basically the logo for Have a Nike Day, which has basically been the tagline for this shoe and Air Max Day itself. And then on the tongue, to show his love for surfing, there's a Velcro patch with a wave on it. Now that's what I call wavy. That was dead, why would I say that? They ask you how you are, and you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. With a retail price of 125 pounds, these have sold out everywhere. Being one of the hardest shoes to get this year, they're reselling now at over 400 pounds. Mad, I know. And I know what you're thinking. Well, Timmy, if they're so hard to get, how the hell did you get a pair? And I can probably show you better than I can tell you. With that being said, run the tape. Yeah, all right, so as I said earlier, we're on our way to the sneaker store, which is next door to us. Why? Because we're gonna try and get our hands on the Weatherspoon 1 slash 97. MX or whatever what you say. Hit the buzzer. Okay. So the way this is working is a check-in system for the queue. So we put our name down earlier in the day, but at four, and then they ask you to come back at six. Then they ask you to come back at ten, and every two hours after that, basically to show that you're still in the queue, which is a pretty good system, which worked out perfectly for us because we live next door to the store, which is absolutely epic. I'm gonna have to stay up every night, so it includes 10 o'clock, midnight, two. two, four, six, eight, and the store opens at 10. And then if those who are not missing, who are not present when they do the check-in, which is now, get crossed off and everyone else gets bumped up the list, that light though, 
Anyway, so this is the first check-in. Baby girl's with me. She's on the list too. She's not going to stay on the list because she's just not going to wake up. I'm not going to force her to. Um, but that's calm. We only need the one pair, so that's exciting. So we're going to see how this goes as usual. I'll show you the crowd. Um, yeah, I can show you from now, in fact. But it's not actually too bad. So you can tell we're already here. That's how close we are to the store, which is perfect. I'm gonna look weird with this camera and shit, but who cares? Let's see how this goes. Quite frankly, I'll focus then. <laughs> yeah. So not too many people hoping in to pick up a little dub tonight. We'll see how this goes. So the time now, I've not got my watch on, like a waste man, is we got for the silver screen. No. It's 9.54, that's not happening, it's 9.54 right now. And the check-in is at 10, and then everyone buggers off and comes back at midnight. So, pretty straightforward. It's a little chilly out here, but it's not that bad. So it looks like these guys are running the show. They have a little list going, a little book, um, and there's a list in there, and the super stuff. What do you mean? Like, the way they write everyone. Yeah, it's nice. It's nice. Everyone gets to see the list. I think people take pictures of the list and stuff. But yeah, not the worst. People are going to join, yeah, I'm sure. But they've got the picture now. I'm seeing people I recognize, which is yeah, quite nice. So we're in the queue, and this guy's already got them on. It's right for some, isn't it? Who's here? Look at this guy. That's what we're going for today. He's cheeky, to look good on feet. Not sure why he's here. We later found out that this guy was a reseller and actually had seven people in the queue for him, who all got pairs. Mental. Anyway, back to the show. That's cool. Lovely stuff. Now he's posing. He's definitely posing. Yeah, he sees me, he sees me. I know you see me. Dickhead. Hey, Jacopo Butti. Elia Ugolini, Matteo Maccioni, Giulio Lami, Meng Yang, Zhang Wei Cheng, Timi Tinibu. Yo! Just man's step. Anyway, so there you have it. Pretty straightforward. Not mad at that. As you can see, the, the crowd is a bit kind of dispersing now. They're going to go find some bars. It's Friday night and whatnot. People are joining to the queue as well, which is cool. So there's a few heads who are like in charge of it, just taking care of it. No idea how that guy gets them. I mean, there were a lot, a lot of pair of cedars. Yes, shouts out to you lot. Yeah. <laughs> Don't know who they are, but whatever. Um, that was kind of crazy. Uh, so now we just go, you just go do that yeah. six times. No, nah, I just got to do that. No. Nah. Yeah, six more times. Six more times. Yeah. So next one's at midnight. We're heading back to the house now. Just to go to bed, really. And that's easy. I'm not going to record the rest of them. I might record them closer to see how we do. And of course, I will record the day that they open. They open at 10. We have to be at the room by 11. So we've got a busy morning ahead of us because of it. Focus. There you go. Back out here in the streets of Florence. Time now is, forgot to watch on again. That's cool. Time is now 11.51, see if you guys can see that. Yeah, we got it. You see it, you believe me. 11.51, as you can see, just like that, we're already at the spot. So no big deal there. So this is the second check-in. I'm not gonna, you know how this works already, so I'm gonna quickly go over, get my name, and go back to lie down. All right, safe. Don't wait, Yo. 
Zhang Wei Chang. Yeah. Team meeting. Yo. Zhang Wei Chang. Team me. Yo. Hey. Zhang Wei Chang. Team me. Yo. Zhang Wei Chang. Team me. Team me. Yo. And we're back. Oh, looking chic. Oh, oh, kill him, babe. So we are now in the queue. The time now is 11 past 10. What's the time? 11 past 10. Story is still closed. So the queue is popping. Still not confirmed what space I am. I'm at 24, 25, 23. Hope it doesn't make much of a difference. So we're still waiting. We need this door to open quick because we have got places to be. Legit. So we've got to check out of our room and then get to some breakfast and get somewhere else. So on and so forth. All right, so there's been a little movement. We are closer to the door. Two people have got them walked out. It's one per person. It's one per person, one in at a time, which is nice. You get a whole little like one-on-one -on -one experience, which is going to be quite cool. Still don't know what sizes might be mine. But it's cool. Fingers crossed, we're still in a very good position in the queue and stuff. <laughs> yeah? Woo! I'm joking. We're in now. Let's see how this goes. I need a 12 UK. 13 US. Oh, okay. Ooh, come on. Come on. What? <laughs> Alright, we're living. Good. Thank you, brother. Yes, there's only one of them. Only one? Of oh, this one? This size? No, other 12. No, this one. Only this size? The other is in the raffle. Oh, wow. Only size. Only one. It's destiny, baby. Destiny. Worth the way. Worth the way. Worth a little journey there. We got a dub. We got a little dub. And I'm out here. Quick retail price. We'll take that. No resell over here. You wait. Ah, it feels good. Look at me walking away from the queue. Look at me walking away from the queue. Yes, come on. Now, for those who don't know, that's actually my first, one of my first camp out experiences, if not the first real camp out experiences. That was dope. Uh, we got the dubs, that makes it even better as well. What is really good. Right, Florence, you just got clocked, bruv. So there you have it. That's how I got my pair. It wasn't easy, but definitely worth it. A big shout out to SOFT for that seamless launch and everyone in the queue who helped me with that crazy language barrier. And I guess big shout out to Hannah for hooking up the Airbnb next to the store. I know it was an accident, but great job. So all right guys, that's it from me. And as always, show your support by liking this video and comment down below if you're feeling the brand new Air Max, if you've got a pair, if maybe you'll be copying a pair on resale, or just let us know your thoughts on everything, to be honest. Why not? So as always, follow us on both our socials. Instagram is purekicks.ig and Twitter is purekicks underscore TW. So all right, guys, that's it from me. This is the Air Max 197 vote forward, John Weatherspoon. I'm Timmy from Pure Kicks. Let's get it. <laughs>